McIlroy did nothing wrong, according to the regulatory committee, but the location of the measurement of relief from an embedded lay above a bunker was off. Rory McIlroy did not make much use of the circumstance, had ultimately had no bearing on the result. However, the decision he received on the 14th hole during the US Open final round at the Los Angeles Country Club is still being debated 10 days later, in part because of the peculiar circumstances and his notoriety in the sport. Additionally, a USJ official told Sports Illustrated in an interview on Monday that while Mr. Roy did nothing illegal, his measurement of his point of relief from an embedded lay above a bunker was made at the wrong location. Thomas Pagel, the USJ's chief governance officer, stated that the nearest point of relief was misidentified. It should have been directly behind the ball. Go to the nearest spot in the general region if there is no area directly behind the ball. However, if you examine the region where the ball was lodged, you'll see that there was a patch of grass there. That should have been the starting point. Pagel remarked, his ball was completely embedded. Also entitled to relief is a ball that is immersed but not in sand. Now Rory followed the referee's instructions to the letter. She made the independent decision that the ball's side should serve as the reference point for relief. And it concludes the matter in terms of the ruling. She is a very qualified referee, according to Pagel, and she followed all the rules when operating the drop. Nevertheless, following more examination, it was discovered that the reference point for relief was located roughly exactly behind the ball.